Good morning. Nine million. That's the number of people who are living with HIV today and have no idea. The new report shows that of the 35 million people worldwide living with the disease, nearly one fourth don't even know they're infected. Now, just in the U.S., it's estimated 181,000 people are unaware they're HIV positive. But there is good news. Research also suggests as people do find out about their status, they are seeking life-saving treatment and achieving viral suppression. This means they are unlikely to transmit the virus to their sexual partners. Now, one medical examiner says if we can close the gap of people who know their status and those who don't, he believes we could be on the track to end the epidemic by 2030. And there also may be a new course of treatment for those suffering from irregular heartbeats. After 10 years of research, scientists are testing a new biological pacemaker by injecting genes into the hearts of sickly pigs. Now this attempt, this new attempt uses gene therapy to reprogram some existing muscle cells, making them function as a natural pacemaker cells. The next step is human testing. The patient's own heart cells are being reprogrammed or transformed by this human gene called TBX18 to become a pacemaker cell that can give spontaneous heart rhythm and rates over the course of life. Scientists hope the first step in human studies will be in about three years. Long-term studies in animals, again, are currently underway. And parents always say the first few years of uh, their child's birth don't expect much sleep. But two New York doctors claim to have figured out a way to get your baby to sleep through the night finally. Fox's uh, Joel Waldman put it to the test. 